a human being and a person are not the same thing. We've been led to believe that they are, but they're not. In Black's Law Dictionary, you'll find the definition of a person, and it says, a human being is not a person because he is a human being, but because rights and duties have been ascribed to him. Specifically, the person is that legal subject or substance of which the rights and duties are attributes. But not all human beings are persons, as was the case in Old England when there were slaves. You are not a person, you have a person. We've been, if you never know that this person exists, if the government is acting upon it, you are unaware of its existence, you're a slave to your own ignorance. The purpose of our, our of this person hasn't, it wasn't to deceive you, it wasn't to enslave you, it was to provide you with a very strong level of protection against government tyranny. If they never act against you as a human being and they're only acting against your person, you always have the option to reject their governance and therefore escape tyranny totally and absolutely peacefully. They'll tell you I'm an agent for the government, I'm a peace officer, I'm this, I'm that. No! You are a human being in a common law jurisdiction, and that's all there is to it. That's first and foremost, and I'm not forgetting that. If you remember that, they have to remember that. The key thing about remembering this is you can remember a couple of things. Yes, you can affect them. You can use, they will respond to emotion. They will respond to threats. They'll respond to a, a baseball bat at the bottom of their knee. They will respond. They will also respond to love, compassion, and truth. 